Greetings everyone, my name is Ari Steele and welcome back to the final station. Our last adventure, we came across some more survivors, so now we're currently at three total. And we finally made it to Risto where we could dump off the cargo that we've been lugging around for the past two to three stations. Now we're here in the subway, I guess we're at the metro or a metro station, I'm not too sure. But we have to find David, who has the transfer code so that we can get the hell out of here. But that's not the worst part. The worst part is this. And I have no idea how I'm going to deal with any of it. I'm thinking I could pop these guys in the back of the heads, but it's a waste of ammo, and I'm kind of wondering if I could cheese this. Oh my god! They're like friggin' piranhas. Oh Jesus, that's creepy. So, oh this is tricky. Oh this is tricky. Oh shit. Okay. It's like blood in the water to these guys. Oh, this is going to be bad. This is going to be so bad. Come on. Whoop, whoop, whoop. I saw you. I saw you, little bastard. Can't get me. I'm like right above their head. Oh, come on. Give me some space. Yes, 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 yes. Got him. Oh, I took three out with that punch. Beautiful. Okay, so the strategy here is just basically... I'm just going to have to do like hit and runs. I'm going to have to lure them. These little guys are pains in the asses, though. They're the ones that are really screwing me up here. Because the ones, the tall guys, I can deal with them no problem. It's a matter of, like, they're just constantly running up on me. And I need them to go away. I need all of you to go away. Please. Please go away. Ah, ooh, okay. I can punch him and do a quick run for it. Oh boy, alright, that took a little longer than expected, but I did it. I punched my way through every single one of them bastards. I had to use one bullet on the armored one, though. That was the only exception. Oh shit, okay. I didn't realize there was another one. Come on. Come on. Come on. I know you know I'm here. Ah shit! I missed, I whiffed it. <laughs> oh well, that's okay. Wow, there's absolutely no items. Oh, you had items. Oh no, you have a letter. Uh, Peter, if it's true and you hold information about a person, or persons, who came from across the border of the first visitation, I'm gonna wait for you on the subway at 1415. You know who it is. Oh. Oh, information. Someone's got dirty little secrets. Alright, hey. Wait a minute. I punched out this window. You biased it. Trying to do repairs on me? Who do you think I am? Alright, so now I have to be extremely careful because I have no idea what's going to come out of anywhere here. This is all, all new. I mean, all game's new, but you know what I mean. No power. Oh boy, okay. And then I need to find a battery. Nothing, nothing. Okay, well, there's the bat. Oh, shit! Alright, cool. Little one, awesome. And, ugh, take that. <laughs> I don't know why. Punching them is just, it's funny, and it's satisfying all at the same time. And I think, uh, oh, I went too far. I think the little guys are, uh, I think the little guys take two power punches in order to really take them out. I think it was like two or three. I couldn't, I couldn't really count. When I was dealing with the cluster, because I would hit them as they were, like, running through everything, and then I'd run back upstairs. And that was pretty much it. Uh, okay, nothing of danger here. Pistol ammo. Uh, this is T12. I have raised the elevator before leaving there. Uh, excuse me. There will be an unscheduled dump from the North Artery in the morning. I'm sick of cleaning the elevator every time. Oh, so they, this... Okay, this is like a sewer, then. Oh, whoop, 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 whoop. Hey, 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 none of that there. All right, I'm going to try doing this again. Um, Come on. Gotcha. All right, there's one. Now I can actually count. Then again, I don't know which one I'm going to actually hit properly. <laughs> if you could, like, run away, that'd be great. Uh, Shit, come on. One of yous. One of yous. There we go. Okay, yeah, so it takes two. It takes two super punches to take them out. Alright, so I'm gonna punch this little bastard because I don't want to waste the ammo. I got 26 rounds, but... <laughs> I don't want to pl plug them into him. 
I don't like though that punching them stops their attack outright. Ugh. Ha, good, awesome, dead. Take that. And don't you come back no more. I don't want to deal with it. Nothing else in here. Nothing else in here. Staff only. Well, I am apparently staff right now. Nothing you could do about it. Fight me, yo. In here. Hi. Ooh, okay. 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 So this is easy to deal with. Um, if you could all just kind of go in that general direction. No, all all in one direction. All in one direction. Uh, God damn. Okay. Never mind. Bang. Take you out. Okay. Run down. And then. Let's see. Punch you. Go down. Actually, I wonder, does it take a super punch to knock off their helmet or just a regular punch? I kind of don't want to... I don't know. Bang! And then... Bang! Ha-ha! Ooh, I got some money. I don't know what good it'll do me. Oh, hi! Empty! Well, great. Oh, it's a basement, cafe, uh, limited, I guess. I don't know what else is up there. Alright, let me head down here, because there's a couple... I'm going to go back down this way, because there were... I think there was a door down here. No, there wasn't. I thought there was. There's this door. The staff only though. No, not up. This way. Oh, okay. Um, do I really want to deal with you? Come on. Bang! <laughs> Hit you in the face, buddy. Oh, man, this is going to be long and tedious. Ooh, it's another one of them things. Yeah, see, this thing is buried right into the, uh the underground garage so this thing definitely fell from a high altitude there's no doubt I'm still under speculation that's all oh there's another one too whoa, whoa anything oh okay screws and items screws and wires very good this one's not giving off any sound though anything hello Ah, shit! I knew it! I knew there was one in the toilet! Ew, dude! You gotta have more fiber, man! You pooped all over the place! Look at it dead! Ooh, shotgun ammo! Nice! Ooh, there's a lot of stuff up here! Ooh, it's looking like a lot of boxes, though! Give me that, and... Ugh, take that! Down, down, down! <laughs> Alright. Give me a clear path here, people! Come on! Come on! Ugh, take that! <laughs> oh, you trying to get a bite off on me? You don't want to chew on me. I taste bad. I taste so bad. Alright, get some distance because the little guy's going to charge in front of all of them. Or not. Aw, oh, you came too late, you bastard. God damn it. Alright, took that helmet off. Ooh, I can kind of cheese that and get it while not being fully on the floor. Huh. Come here. Ugh. <laughs> Major threat eliminated. Alright, the rest of these guys I can deal with no problem. So let's see. If you all would just kindly cluster. I was hoping to get the other one without armor, but that's fine. Alright, so now I can get him. And bang. And then run past you. And then bang. And then bang. <laughs> oh, I am so freaking amazing. Anything of use? What is there? Money? Ooh, heavy bags. Aw, oh, man, I like that there's a lot of weights here. Um, oh, here we go. We got more. All right, so let me grab one of them, and then... Ugh, take that. Ha, 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 ha. All right, grab this. Now, this I gotta kind of have to time, because they're gonna cluster together, and I don't want to hit the wrong one. Let me just do that. Nice. Perfect. Awesome. Ooh, and get myself a nice big old flat screen TV, 4K. Looks like, what do you got there? Looks like a white Xbox One. Punch you, run by you. Ah, shit, I shouldn't have backed up. Damn it. Oh, I screwed up. Ugh! Ha ha ha! Take that! Um, let's see. Oh, actually. Ugh! And, ugh! <laughs> I like it. Alright, more money. Ooh, 54 bucks. Nice. Alright, let me grab this TV, because I might need it. Nothing up here, really? This whole place is barren? Oh, oh, okay. What do you got? Handcuffs? What kind of kinky stuff are you doing in the kitchen? Oh, he was marking down how many days he was stuck in there. Oh, you probably died of starvation. Well, that sucks. 
All right, well, heading on down, heading on down. Can I get past this? I can. And ugh, take that. <laughs> Sucker! Bang! That right, takes care of that. All right, cafe. Uh oh. Oh no! Get up! Get up! Get up! Get up! Get up. Shit! Um. Oh ho ho ho! Oh, how come he didn't get affected? That's not right. He was right on top of the blast radius. Ah, oh, that's cheap. That's so cheap. Can I pick up a drum? Oh, I can play it. <laughs> that's nice. I like that. I can't open that? Oh, it must be locked. Okay. So I guess I gotta go down and around. Alright, what's in here? Oh, you're just a normal one. And bang! <laughs> Coins and a med kit. Perfect. Alright, more money. Good. Could always use some more monies. Ooh, books. Use me a nice book. <gasps> no one into books. I guess the zombies don't like to read. Guardian, fact or fiction, what honest citizens' taxes are really spent for? By Erwin B. Omega Publishing. Oh. He's talking the real talk. Trying to uncover the truths. Nope, I still can't open this door. Huh. Interesting. Alright, I gotta shoot them because... I guess I could have probably ran by him and went up the stairs. That's alright though. We're doing pretty good on ammo. All right, nothing in the alleyway. See, now this isn't emitting any sound. So I wonder why some do and some don't. Uh, welcome to Peace and Quiet Resort. Patrons are provided three meals and recovery activities. Procedures start at 8 o'clock. Or $8, rather. Diner is served at 9. Oh, no. No, it is 8. Okay, 8 and 9. Uh, cutlery is not provided. Please restrain from leaving... The resort building without warning staff members administration. Yeah, cutlery isn't provided because you got somebody stealing all the spoons. Whoa, what the hell? What's with all the gear work in the wall? I knew something was wrong with this house. No one believed me. Last week they came for Matthew Bello and yesterday they came for the guy upstairs. I heard them come in. I'm the next one, no doubt. Uh-oh. They're coming in and taking people. They're going snatching up all y'all people. Welcome to blah, blah, blah. Okay, I already read that. Uh, whiskey. Okay, nothing in here. Okay, and blah, take that. And hello? Uh, report number 403. The specimen is handled. Immobilized, placed in general storage. Tidy up the room. Change bed sheets. New inhabitant in three days. BLO2. Yeah. All right, so... They are definitely abducting people to test on. I, I knew it. This is all a government conspiracy. I called it. I news it. Get the hell off of me, foo. Make me waste my ammo on your ass. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. No. No. Get up the stairs. Ah, oh, come on. I got caught on the railing. That wasn't cool. God damn it. Get up. Why wouldn't he get up? Oh, that's so bullshit. Oh, come on, man. All right, got him. God damn. I don't like that. You know, I was like right here and I get caught on like very little off the stairs and you get caught on the railing. I don't like that at all. Okay. One of these jumbos. Who wants some? Come on. I'll take on both of you. Yeah, keep walking that direction. Ugh, take that. <laughs> Sucker. That's what you get. All right, so what I got to do here, I got to charge up, I got to punch, and then, ugh. All right, takes care of that. Med kit, guardian keychain. Well then, something is off in the house next to me. I heard screams last week, but I don't care about that now. I dreamt of those symbols again. The old man told me about the canyon and the mountains to the west. He thinks they will start from there. If so, I need to be there when they open the passage. I can't get there via south. I'll take a shortcut through the metropole. All right, see, so now, something about the valley, too. Oh, hi. You're a lot of people. Um, hold still. Are you from the train? Uh, yes, can you not tell? 
Well, I'm sorry. We've got two, three in here. You must take them. I'm not going. Got unfinished business here. All right. Um. No, I have my ammo. Just worry about yourself. Okay. Uh, don't be ridiculous. I'm dead weight. Others need you more. Oh, I'm dead weight. Okay. <laughs> they spelt it wrong. A train? Yes, a train. Okay, I'm waiting for you there. All right, so now I got four passengers. Thank God. Okay, I'll try. Oh, no, he was another one that was bleeding out. Ah, oh, crap. All right, well, I got five med kits. I got four food. Oh, this is going to be very tricky. All right, here's the code. Metropole Upper House to David Rowland, head of New Cosfield Station. Blocker code confirmation 8865. Oh, this is going to be bad. And I got me a key. All right, let's head on the hell out of here. I'm not liking this. I took on two more people. I have four things of food. One of them's already going to need food. And I think two of them are going to need med kits. Oh, hey, what's up, buddy? Um, move faster. Let me move faster. I am not leaving without David. David's dead. All right, whatever. Whatever you say, buddy. I mean, it's, it's your call. 8865. I don't understand why I wouldn't tell him that. I'd be like, dude, David's dead. Get on the fucking train. Come on. What are you waiting for? That level was a little long. There was a lot to go through there. I mean, of course, me dying and having to restart back at a certain checkpoint didn't help, but that was a bit of a big level. I liked it, though. It was fun. I like punching all those zombies. Yeah, see, now I gotta deal with two guys that are bleeding. Ah, god damn it. Alright, who's getting hungry? You're getting hungry, so let me get you food. Alright, there was shopping center where it all began. Um, what's sparking? Oh, this is sparking. Okay. Who's... Oh, shit. Okay, 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 okay. I got you, I got you. I got you. Hold on. Hold on. Whoa. What is that? What is going on? Whoa, what happened? Oh, we rolled through the fog. What a... What the hell? Oh, God. What is it? Oh, my God. It was a nuke. But there were people there. I think so. So this is what that is was in that cargo? I shipped a tactical nuke? Thank God. All right, you're doing good. You're... Is this... Is it Bristol? Yes. What is this? It's the main plant. Nebelhurst. I don't feel good. No, you don't feel good. Okay. Medkit for you. And hop in. There you go. Alright, he's getting hungry. You're getting hungry. You're getting hungry. Fuck. I got three things of food. Hold on. I gotta see if I can craft stuff. Alright, craft that. Craft ammo. And I can craft shotgun ammo? Oh, man. I was really wishing I could craft food. Um... All right, you're wait. You're hungry. All right, you're gonna hung. You're getting hungry. Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh shit! My bad. I forgot to. Oh no. Oh, I neglected that. Damn. Shit. All right, get up. Get off. Get off. Get off. Get off. Oh, oh, oh no. And he's dying again. Damn it. This is becoming too chaotic, and I don't like it. It's becoming way too chaotic. I mean, I'm glad that I don't have to deal... Oh, thank God. Thank God I left them off. Oh, God. That was so stressful. I wasn't going to make another trip with them. Okay, they all survived. That's good. All right. Rhonda Miles gave me 100 bucks. Ron Cocker survived. I got ammo. $60. Bob Nelson survived. I don't know what this is. Uh, all pills, it looks like. Martin Jarvis, 140 bucks. Scott Denman, 70 bucks and two things of ammo. And $210 from Amanda. Okay, thank God. All right. All right, we're at Bristol. Thank you again. Yeah, well, excuse me. I have a few things to discuss. Nobody here knows what's going on, it appears. He, he should be fine. Once again, what has bit you like that? 
I hope they don't get transformed by the bites, too. I know you have already figured out where this is going. Grab your family and save yourself, Conductor. I'm pretty sure my family is nowhere to be found. Oh, yeah, you have an order. This guy just smoking. Hey, he don't care. He just wants his smoke. All right. Bleeding is now stabilized. Ambulance will soon arrive. He needs hospital treatment. Oh, and your bandaging skill is lacking, matter of fact. Oh, yeah, because he kept fucking bleeding out. Don't run upon me, dude. Thought you were one of them. Okay, we should be safe here in this city. Peace, bro. Um, peace to you as well. All right. Who am I talking to here? Are you driving from the north? Is everything okay there? No, they just launched... They just set off a nuke. I can't talk to, contact them for some reason. Because they've been all nuked. By the way, did you hear the strange noise about an hour ago? It was a nuke. <laughs> How many times do I got to say it? Um, nuclear? Are you sure? I don't really understand. What's not to understand? They launched... Uh, never mind. I'm done saying it. <laughs> Sorry, I have work to do. Okay, cool. Um, what's in here? Um, what's up, buddy? Eh, routes to the north are canceled. I'm sick of waiting to do my job. Well, I'm the one doing my job. Cool, got me a med kit. All right, yeah, this is a safe zone because I don't have any of my stats down below. Lovely weather we got, don't you think? For the moment, it is a nice sunset rise. I don't know which way the sun's going. Adam Thornton wants to see you. It's an urge. It's it is urgent. He said. Okay. Uh, mind your tongue, Mister. We owe him everything. Keep that to yourself too. His office is on top of the Nebelhurst Tower, visible from everywhere. You can't miss it. We have a driver waiting to to quickly get you there. I'll have your code printed by the time you get back. Oh, okay. Cool. Give me that. Cool. Ooh, a CD disc. Very good. Hey, bro, you want some CDs? Alright, awesome. What's in here? Newspaper gets expensive by the day. News from the outside world would soon be a luxury. Um, what can I... Oh, I can buy a newspaper. Uh, do I want to buy a newspaper? I guess so, why not? Bristol Police Department, under Adam Thornton's orders, has investigated and confiscated a ton of crush electrum. Illegally sourced by Skamen Factory Miners as Skamen Factory Management was caught in an attempt to smuggle it out of Bristol. Oh, so that happened in the train, the first train station that I went to. Um, where I went underground, the guy was like, Halt, or you'll meet this one. Don't come back. Your, your jurisdiction is on trains only. A reminder, any Electrum extracting activities within city pre premises should be licensed and taxed. There's a lot of typos in here. There's a lot of, like, a lot of the terminology and, like, the way the sentence or structures are kind of off, so it's throwing me off in my reading. Too bad after all these years, we have individuals thinking they can steal minerals from my city. Example of today will remind everyone what happens for such scam. I would say such crime, but... Your words are your words. There are rumors about increase in residents' mortality. As a scientist, I've heard stories like these since my first day working in Bristol. We have no interest in keeping our people in, toxic a in, a, in, a, tox in a toxic atmosphere. God damn. We aim for every Electrum miner to live a long and happy life. All right. Well, I guess that's it there. Uh, he will be fine. Oh, dude. You got hit by a car. Damn. Mark my words. That don't look fine. This guy is from the plant. Okay. Um, oh, I can't make it to the other side. Um, that don't look fine at all. All right, there we go. Oh, what's up, baby? Jack, your buddies again? I, I guess. Uh, I, I don't know. Am I? My name's not Jack. My name's Edward. All right, so I can't make it up to the roof to talk to that guy. Oh, you look like you got a sweet guitar. You're jamming out, and I can't make it past the ambulance. Oh, that's cool. Look at the guy sitting in the window. Thanks, mate. A phone? Yeah, there should be a call box in the back alley. Okay. Um, oh, I can take the back alley. All right. Meds. Yes. Give me all the med kits. And what's that? Ammo? I can buy ammo. Ooh, what's this? What is this? Uh, oh, laser sight and extended clip. Ooh. Should I buy... You know what? I'm gonna buy them. Oh, I can only have one or the other? 
Oh, that's not good. Hmm. I guess, I don't know, I guess a laser sight would help out a little bit more. Then again, I mean, I'm pretty good with the headshots. It's just a matter of just pointing the crosshairs over their head. Um, I guess, you know, I'll get the extended clip because having more ammo in the pistol before I have to reload is far better. Um, all right, you got eight rounds, so that's 80 bucks. That's a hundred rounds for two. Uh, yeah, cool. I guess I'll go with that. Mm hmm Sure, why not? Uh, I'm not busy for the rest of the day. I- I don't know what I see- again, I wish I had context! <clears throat> Alright, food, yes, definitely need food. Let's got some food going. Let's talk to this guy. Thank you, but I'm not interested. Go annoy someone else. Alright, fine, I'll go annoy someone down here then. You got anything? No? How about you? Get into the car you were being waited for. I want to get into the car. Not yet. I got to go down. All right. So this is where I got to go to go meet the guy that wants to talk to me. But I'm going to go into the back alley and go talk to the payphone. Because I've never been able to go to like different parts of a city. It's always just been linear. So this is really cool. Um, all right. Which way am I going? Let's just go to the right here, I guess. So up, little birds? Um, hi. Another visitor. That's it. Nothing else. It's upstairs. Um, Hi. Visiting my grandpa, aren't you? Um, I guess he is in his room, but please be quick. Uh, oh, and spare him questions about settlers. His family has had it rough back then. Okay, um, I didn't realize I was actually here to talk to your grandpa. Oh god, look at him. Hey, did you get my cranberries? Um, hi. Yes, I've been there the first visitation. I am often asked to speak about it, but I notice that hardly anyone truly listens. Well, I'm listening. After all these years, I suppose nobody needs the truth. It all started with capsules falling from the sky. I knew it! I knew they fell from the sky! One of them has landed a block away from us. The gas around them wasn't affecting people somehow. It's good you know already. Yes, this detail is ignored by most. Not everybody was affected in the same way. <laughs> Sorry, talking ain't so easy for me now. I knew it! Oh my god! Memoirs, Recollections of the vis Visitation, page 273. Everyone who got across the zone of visitation was treated badly. The very first night, locals burst into our tent and attacked us. They beat my father to death at the time and dragged my mom somewhere. I never saw her again. It appeared that none of the locals took the story seriously. They thought we were just mi migrants in search of a better life. I think that means immigrants, but... No, migrants. Yeah, because they were migrating. Okay, never mind. Right, right word. Uh, a month later, Vermin White came to power. Oh, okay, here's the payphone. Cool. Gotcha. Alright, cool. Um, good talking to you, I guess. Uh, ooh, there's a car. And Alright, I'm gonna go back up and around. I wanna see what's in this room down here. Maybe there's some items of interest. Uh, no, there is not. Okay, so I guess we can go downstairs. Um, should be nothing bad down there, considering that I don't have my weapon out. Oh man, this is getting really into Wow, that's a lot of liquor. Um, hi! You're all drunk. Um, could you please shut the door? Before we're seen? Man, you're all mooching off their, their alcohol. <laughs> you bunch of hobos. Alright, cool. So, uh, that's where I came in from. Hello, lovebirds on the roof. How you doing? Enjoying the night sky? I bet you is. What's up, buddy? Uh, we are not open yet. Well, I just came in, so that's contradicting to what you just said. If you look for a room, go upstairs. I mean, if I'm looking for a room? Um, hi. Well, we have two rooms vacant. The first is to the right, but it needs extensive cleaning, so Madman's been renting it. Some Madman's been renting it. Uh, and then we have a separate lodging, and there is that leaking pipe. Feel free to look around. Okay, cool, awesome. Um, kind of just going around and... 
getting some exposition here. I've met the old man today. Looks like he has lost his marbles already. Nevertheless, he has told me something very important concerning the first visitation. I must get to that canyon, but the train is only heading west in a week. I'll go north in the morning. It'll be faster this way. Oh, okay. Alright, can't go into that room. Is this the madman's room? I bet it is. Are you the madman? Oh, hello. Run where? For what? Eh. Okay, I guess, uh, nothing of import there. Ha, another spoon! Spoon! Alright, that's everything. So, I guess I can head on back and go take the car. And go talk to, uh, Mr. Billionaire Businessman Moneyface on what it is that he wants me to talk about. Hello, hello. Alright. Into the car. I don't like this. I feel like I'm gonna get abducted. Hello. Good afternoon. Are you on appointment? Yes, I am. I will take a look. Well. Yes, Mr. Thornton is expecting you. Come in. Okay, cool. Um, the door's to the right, sir. Hello? What the hell is all this? Hi? This crystal alone powers our plant and the whole city. Its condition, however, should be monitored persistently. Should a single surface overheat, well, terrible things will happen. Oh, okay. And where did you obtain said crystal in order to... I don't want to talk to you just yet. I want to see what you got in your office. All right, buddy. Let's say you. Don't worry. I know it. You know what? Electron dust in the air blocks out radio. Population has little idea of what's going on outside. Well, I think they should know. This fog isolates them from the outside world, and they tend to avoid this place. But this is none of your business. Then why didn't you tell me? Now it is my business. Warn them if you must. I doubt highly they will believe you. I would suggest we get down to business. Time is running out. A contract with the council binds me in case of the second visitation to give up the factory power core. To power the guardian with it. The council was to provide transport, but we should both know that your train is the only one running, running for miles around. My order is given. Power core, the power core will be attached to your train, so better hurry up. Blockers are a stick in the wheel for sure, but that is up to you. See you soon. Oh, great. Now I got to escort a crystal? Oh, no. I don't want to do that. Shit. So not only do I have new passengers, but now I got to worry about a crystal. Um, oh, wait. What was... This guy had food, right? I bought all his food. Yeah, he's got nothing else. Okay. I just figured maybe that, like, the... Uh, I just figured that maybe the inventory would maybe kick back up. Guess not, though. All right, cool. So let's head on out. Baby, you sure you don't want to come with me? I could definitely use a passenger like you if you know what I mean. I mean, the cars are pretty open, but, hey, you know, I'm pretty sure some people like to watch. I mean, I us have a conversation. You know, what the hell do you think I'm talking about? Oh, Herbs. Metropole Upper House to Joshua Bands, head of Bristol Station, blocker code confirmation 9732. I talked to you. The cargo is already attached. Have a nice day. Gonna try not to, I guess. Alright, oh, yep, there's the crystal. Okay. Well then, 9732. So is this thing gonna be used as a tactical nuke as well? Because they said terrible things could happen if something obstructs the surface of it. I don't like this. Well, at least I'm high on supplies. So that's good. All right, I got I got one guy. I thought I had a couple. Hey, where are we going? I don't know. Metropole, hmm. All right, Um. oh, what do I have to do? Oh shit, what do I have to do here? Oh, I gotcha, okay. That's what I gotta do. All right, let me check the crafting thing. Make sure there's nothing I can craft. And nope, I am good on crafting. Okay. Ooh, it's the ocean. 
All right. Uh, to look at the Guardian, they say when its engine starts, the whole world will hear it. I hope there won't be a need for it. I don't know either. Also, are you drinking on my train there, buddy? Oh, shit. This is getting high. All right. Gotta purge that. I don't like that I have an unstable crystal on my train. Do you want to know why I am drinking? Yeah, sure you do. I mean, just because you want to? We are settlers. We are being oppressed all the time. Oh, so you're doing it for stress relief. Okay, gotcha. The backgrounds are really pretty. Every damn day. Oh, hold on. I got a message. Let me, uh... Purge that one more time. Alright, what do I got? Tim Lanning. Tim, please, any news from the north? I'm sorry, my friend. I'm stuck in Metropole. They don't let anyone out of here. Council still silent? Is the council still silent? They pretend it's just connection problems. I'm sure they already fled the town. Tim is offline. Oh, shit. Alright, purge that. Uh, it is not my fault that my country was destroyed. That's well, nobody's fault. Except for those in charge. Turn to dust. Oh, you're hungry. All right, hold on. Um, you know what? We're already here. I'll, I'll save that for next time. It's fine. I'll let it carry over. Ooh, I don't want my shotgun out. Switch to my pistol. Okay, yeah, wow. I definitely got a lot more ammo this time. All right, so I think I'm actually going to actually, you know what? Let me, uh, I'm going to leave it here, but yeah, you is a dead man. All right, got me some screws. Got nothing else important here to pick up, I think. All right, let's just check this. Code Red, please retire to the shelter immediately. Code Red, please retire to the shelter immediately. All right, so this is really pretty, though. That is such a serene background. Oh, I like it. It's really, really nice. All right, so now we're getting some more clues as to what's going on. So the pods, as I speculated, did fall from a high altitude, and they emit a gas. I wasn't expecting that it emitted a gas. I I thought that um my first thought was like the the um the ported grates were for like venting reasons, but it does make sense that that could open up and emit some sort of some sort of gas or dust or something. And it affects people and turns them into the creatures, but it affects everyone differently. And the um uh scamum, scamen or whatever it's called, I can't remember what it's called, the um that little chemical but they have that dust going surrounding the main city, so it interrupts communication, but it keeps the creatures at bay. So that's why the communications are down, because the fog is screwing up with all the electronics. And the council isn't admitting to that, so they're, they're basically keeping everyone in the dark so that they can better keep themselves safe and not have to worry about mass panic and having the, the populace come after them and attack them. Because you know how people can be in these situations. They will attack the people in charge because they're going to blame them for everything falling to shit. But this is getting really good, really creepy at the same time. Oh, things are getting really dark. And I'm liking this so far. But anyway, I'm going to pause it right here. Thank you all so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, then thrust your mouse upon that like button. Keep playing it awesome, and I will see you all on my next adventure.